my current visit in the ICTD was to, to deliver a seminar on linking research and policy. What I actually presented was the opportunities that are available for researchers, particularly scholars or external researchers, how their work can fit into the policy design. I'm a tax professional. I have worked as a director of research in the Revenue Authority and also after my academic profession as a holder of a, a doctorate degree, I was appointed as the Commissioner General of the National Revenue Authority. In terms of the work done with the ICTD, include and, um, research on property taxation, we have done research on informal taxation, we have done research on local governance generally. And I can tell you the output of those researches have not only been published in very good journals like the African Affairs and Journal of Development Studies, but outputs are also being used by the city councils in, in Sierra Leone when they are doing their reform. And I can tell you also the work that was done on informal taxation actually informed my team that is the National Revenue Authority when we were designing the presumptive taxation for the smaller businesses. The collaboration between the ICTD and the National Revenue Authority has also yielded something good. Jointly, they were able to host the first international conference on taxation. That created so much impact because now, for the very first time, civil society organizations practitioners, other researchers got to listen to very good papers that were presented on taxation and they were able to see what is happening in other jurisdictions and uh, looking at it with the lens of also that of Sierra Leone. The other thing that they've done with the National Revenue Authority was to do a joint research on high net worth individuals. The research output has not only been published, of course, uh, as a working paper, but that output is very relevant in our design for the high net worth individual taxation. Currently, there is work going on looking at how to have a unit for the implementation of high net worth individuals. My current visit in the ICTD was to, to deliver a seminar on linking research and policy. What I actually presented was the opportunities that are available for researchers, particularly scholars or external researchers, how their work can fit into the policy design. Policy design in most countries, especially LIC, low-income countries, also requires a lot of evidence. Internal researchers cannot provide all these evidences. That means that the opportunity is there for external researchers to collaborate with the internal researchers. When you do joint research, it's a win-win situation because you as an external researcher will have access to internal data, which will be extremely useful for your own work. And also the internal researchers now can benefit from the strong theoretical and methodological advantages which the external researchers have. Although I caution, that when you are in that collaboration, each party should not lose sight of what is actually their own target. Internal researchers are there to provide the solutions to practical problems for the organizations. Whilst you as an external or an academic, you want to add to a broader knowledge. In terms of dissemination, I also was able to tell the external researchers how can they interface with policymakers, and my emphasis there was that you have to note and do your assignment well so that you are clear on what type of information is required by whom. If you are talking to the head of institution, be punchy and ensure that you situate your work 
or your evidence in context because that is what they want to look at if for example you are talking to the cg of the revenue authority you should note that the cg will be interested in the revenue implication as well as the administrative cost of any policy proposal you are making of course if you are talking to the minister of finance i said you need to know that the minister is going to be interested in the revenue implication but he's also going to be interested in the welfare of the citizens so you need to be very punchy you need to ensure that you situate your work very well in the context there is nothing wrong to bring in other examples what happens in other countries but it's going to be impactful but ensure that you take into consideration the context in which you are doing your work